Leo is 19 months and seven months ago he was diagnosed with Angelman syndrome. It's a neurogenetic condition. He has epilepsy, he is tube fed because he has a swallow problem. We can't leave him with the girl next door that would have babysat perhaps our daughter. Um, so having the Jack and Jill nurses to be able to come in and take care of him and give myself and my husband or myself and my husband and my daughter time to spend together as a family is it's invaluable and it's been life-saving to us. To be able to give of your time and your talent in order to help raise money for such an amazingly worthwhile cause, it means a huge amount to us as parents of children with additional needs. Most people don't have money but the fact that they've taken the time to create a piece of art, taken the time to come here and promote the, um, the entire event is it's, it means a lot to us. So it really is about giving the parents a break and um, bringing some nurses into the home, as Joan said, for some time out, a night's sleep. We've yes. had a few nights sleep and uh, time for mum and dad to go out and get a break. And um, again, it's 16 euro an hour for a nursing hour. And Incognito, I think last year raised about 96,000, which is phenomenal amount of money. Our mental health as parents can be, um, it, it can suffer because it's a big, it's a big adjustment, and it's not just the diagnosis and the grief of the diagnosis that we have, but it's also the day-to-day, 24/7 nature of being a mom of a child with additional and complex medical needs. So it's it's been huge for me. If we give parents a break, you know, it gives them that energy. To We're do better the parents. Job. Yeah, we're better know. parents when we have a break. Yeah. We are. And I think that's just so important.